well pulled. You did lose, but just how good were the Arsenal sides? They were very good. Yeah, they were they were a good side. Um, good young players, and there was a few um, first team players who have played a lot of first team games for Arsenal. So um, yeah, no, they they came here and they they showed us a lot of respect, and, and they they played well. And uh, at times it was hard to keep up with, but. There's some positives to take from the game, you know, and then there's obviously lots of things to work on. So, all in all, it was a good exercise. As good as they were, you had your fair share of chances between a lot of you and could have scored arguably a couple of times. Yeah, we had a couple of, uh, couple of half chances, um, but we, we needed to probably be a bit better. When we won the ball back, um, maybe have a spell of, of, of the ball ourselves and, and just try and keep it in it. But it was hard, you know, not only did they they work well when they had the ball, they worked extremely hard off the ball to get it back as well, so they made it very difficult for us and um, you know it's a, it's a great learning experience for, for me so for me as well, you know I'm, I'm 37 but I still learn a lot out of the game so I'm, I'm hopeful that, the, that a lot of our players did the same, you know the young players we've got, so it's a good, like I say, it's a good experience and a, and a, a good lesson. You're playing up front against two full internationals in Matthew Debushi and Carl Jenkinson, how difficult was that? Yeah, no, it's not easy. Um, you know, it's not every day you, you play against players of, of, of that quality. Um, for, unfortunately, I know Carl, uh, Carl Jenkinson quite well. I played with him before at Charlton, so I know what quality he's got. And obviously, you see um, Debussy on the telly and um, and how good and the good quality he's got. And to be fair, the third centre half there as well wasn't too bad either. So they've got they've got quality all over the park. It's hard to deal with. Um, but you know, there's, we'll watch the video, and there'll be certain things that we could have done better for certain goals. I think we, we could have done a bit better. Um, that's if you're being ultra crit critical, which you know I think you've got to be if you want to if you want to be winners. So um, you know, we, we, we'll work on a few things. But you know, they got a good side, and um, it, was a, it was a good exercise, and, and we'll, we'll try and learn from it. On a brighter note, just how special an occasion was this for the club today? Yeah, no, that's um, that's a big part of it. You know, it's um, it's great that this club has that partnership with a with a excellent club like Arsenal. You know, it's a fantastic partnership that they enjoy, um, and it's fantastic that, that Arsenal can can bring the sorts of players they do down here, and um, with the, with the manager coming down as well, it's uh, it's fantastic that they have that that partnership together, and um, hopefully we can um, maybe pick up a few supporters off the back of that. Yeah, a lot of people actually didn't believe that Arsene Wenger and or, or Ivan Gazidis would actually turn up, but they were here, and they were here for the full 90. How pleasing is that to have played in front of such big names? No, it's excellent. Um, it's, it's, always, you know, it's always a learning experience when you play against players of, of that quality. You know, like I said earlier, it doesn't matter how old you are, whether you're 37 or 17, it's, it's, you'll always learn something playing in games like that. And, um, I think uh, probably Arsenal was very pleased with, with what he saw from his players. I think they, they, their attitudes were spot on. It's easy to turn up to a, a, a lesser club and, and not give it 100%, but I thought everyone who played for Arsenal tonight gave Bore and Wood players and club respect it deserved and, and put a full shift in. And obviously why it made it harder for us, it's always, you know, it's always nice when players turn up and do that and make a real good game of it. And um, they certainly did that. And obviously I think Arsenal can be can be proud of their, their players, certainly. No rest by you played Saturday, Monday, today, and you go again on Monday. There's almost no time to train, is there? No, it's not. Um, it's a it's a pretty full-on schedule at the moment. Um, but the National League is, is like that. It's it's pretty full-on. It's Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday for a lot of for a lot of months. Um, so you've got to be um, you've got to be fit and you've got to be ready to play one game after the next, after the next. And we've we've had that run now and. Um, I think it probably showed a little bit tonight. I think where we've had the back, probably the back end of those three games, it's maybe a few tired legs out there. Certainly after half time and, and going on, it was um, maybe a few few tired legs out there. But we'll have a bit of rest now, and we'll go again for Monday for Barnet, and then after that, it's um, it's the big one one we've all, we've prepared for the last four weeks for. So it'll be good, you know, it's, you, you certainly want to be involved in these sorts of games and um, you don't want to be missing out on any of them.